Je voudrais, si son Excellence, Monsieur, son Excellence, son Altesse Cheikh Chabot Bin Nayan Al Nayan, veut bien prendre la parole, nous sommes, nous serons heureux de l'entendre. Chers amis, dames et messieurs, bonjour. Bonjour. Uh, excuse me, I'll be continuing in English. I wish I spoke French better. I'm working on my French, I promise you that. Um, first of all, welcome to the United Arab Emirates. We are very honored and glad to have you here. Uh, and I very much hope that uh, you've enjoyed your stay uh, so far. And uh, I also hope that uh, you have had and continue to have uh, fruitful and constructive discussions to help uh, not only uh, your colleagues, but also policymakers in, in hopefully taking the right decision and the right approach to facing uh, common challenges uh, and uh, uh, threats that may uh, be seen in the uh, near uh, future. Uh, nevertheless, I am very much delighted and honored to be here with you today to participate uh, in this uh, roundtable discussion. Um, extending from my senior leadership uh, belief of wise leadership in strengthening international cooperation and solidarity. It is a genuine honor to represent the UAE uh, and its capacity in all efforts to develop bridges of understanding throughout the African continent and the rest of the international world. I would also like to extend my appreciation to the organizers of this event and all the invitees who have joined us here in Abu Dhabi. It is evident that so much effort has been dedicated to its planning and execution, and you expect great outcomes. And thanks to you all uh, for your uh, interventions. Uh, there is no doubt that the UAE is wholeheartedly invested in the future of Africa and its people. And of course, we continue to hopefully play a proactive, uh, and a valuable role in Africa, bringing, coming from our ethics and our standards and our values in providing and uh, reflecting peace, security, prosperity, uh, fraternity, uh, coexistence. Uh, just, I'll, I'll go out of my, uh, step away slightly from my uh, speech but it is, I think, very relevant to say that the UAE has been founded in 1971 without one drop of blood, nor one round of bullet. Uh, so we, are, we have been built with uh, coexistence and peace, warmth, and love to one another. And this is what we uh, want to um, export and showcase to our partners and our trusted allies internationally. Um, we are excited to enter a new era post-COVID-19 when we will be able to build stronger partnerships across Africa and across the world with the hopes of creating a better future for our countries and regions a future built on stability, security, and sustainability. We understand that the only way to achieve this is through dialogue, open channels of communication, the exchange of knowledge, and above all, the development of strategic partnerships that are mutually beneficial. The UAE is proud of its long-standing relations with the African continent and the rest of the world. We share a vision of boosting prosperity for our peoples and creating opportunities for coming generations. We are certain that we will continue to enjoy fruitful partnerships by strengthening ties of cooperation 
in pursuit of a more prosperous future. We will explore all available opportunities to cooperate and advance our relations, proactively engaging across different fields and sectors. We will join efforts to address global issues that influence our stability to grow as partners. We will continue to work together on pressing global challenges, including counter-terrorism and extremism, combating climate security, improving food security, and more so. To enable this, we need platforms such as the World Policy Conference that allow us to discuss the most problematic issues and collectively determine solutions. These events also bring about the opportunity to advance our relations to new heights. I would like to thank you for having me here, joining this panel and roundtable, and I very much look forward to witnessing its productive outcomes. I wish you all a happy and a fruitful time in the UAE, and the very best wishes. Thank you. Uh, Votre Excellence, Votre Altesse, uh, je voudrais, au nom de tous les participants à cet atelier, vous remercier de cet honneur que vous nous faites. Non seulement par votre présence, mais également par les propos que vous venez de nous délivrer. Vous avez mis l'accent sur la tolérance et vous êtes le seul pays au monde où l'un des rares, je, par prudence je dis l'un des rares, mais je crois que vous êtes le seul, les Émirats arabes unis, seul pays au monde à avoir un ministère chargé de la tolérance. Si cet amour du prochain vous réussissez à nous en contaminer, et ce serait merveilleux. Nous le souhaitons. J'étais ici, dans votre pays, il y a un certain temps, en 1995, j'étais ministre des Affaires étrangères de mon pays, en visite officielle, et j'avais déjà eu des entretiens dans, dans ce sens-là à l'époque, et cela m'est resté, et je suis personnellement heureux que vous veniez raviver cela. Alors, Nous vous remercions d'être là et je vous dis que nous serons heureux si vous, pouvez si vous pouviez participer au débat jusqu'à la fin, si votre programme vous le permet, ça nous rendra encore bien plus heureux. Merci, Votre Altesse.